What is going on my friends today back with another video and this video is actually going to give you guys a lot of value because this is something that actually has solved a huge problem of mine and I think that if you guys actually check this out it can save you hours upon hours of time whether it's for short films music videos any kind of video projects there's a lot of syncing audio involved and it's a very painstaking process of finding a spot in the audio and then matching it up to another audio source so recently I stumbled across this software right here called Synkyla so I'm going to give you guys a full review of this because I've actually been loving this because it's been making my life 10 times easier with all these music video projects that I've been doing. I'm gonna show you guys how it works. And another thing about why I chose this, it gives you a 30 day free trial as well as you can use it for Premiere, Final Cut, Sony Vegas, a bunch of other different editing softwares. So if you look on the website right here, it actually shows how to use it. All you need to do is export an XML file from your editing program, bring it into Syncalia, and then save a new XML file and then bring that back into your editing software. So this process is actually very easy. Let's hop into Premiere right now. I'm gonna show you guys how to do that. So in here we have the music that I want to sync and then we have a bunch of different shots right here so what we're gonna do is go up to file we're gonna go to export right here and then we're going to select Final Cut Pro XML and then click OK and then we can just save this wherever I'm just gonna name this sync and all you have to do is just click this open XML button now I'm just gonna navigate to wherever I save that file right here it's just called sync I'm gonna click open you see all the audio files instantly load into here and you can see the recording as well as the cameras right here so easy sorting there's no loading screens instantly goes right in there and then all you have to do is just click the synchronize button and then you're done so now we have everything all completely synchronized literally just happened in one second so super fast we're gonna go ahead and click save XML and then we're gonna click save so now we're gonna go ahead and click file we're gonna click open project and we're gonna open up that XML file that was exported from Synkyla so let's go ahead and open that up and we're just gonna say no to this and now as you see all of the clips are perfectly aligned so just to prove to you this is all synced what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna let everything play I'm not gonna mute any of the tracks and you're gonna hear this 100% in sync just like the song is actually playing even though this is like seven tracks stacked on top of each other so like I said, I've been searching for something like this for so long because it's such an annoying process to actually have to sync that. It can honestly take like hours depending on how many clips you have. So I was super glad that I found this software and I actually reached out to them. If you guys would like, there's gonna be a 10% off code down in the description of this video. Pretty sure the prices for license of this actually aren't even that expensive. Um, as you see right here, the prices are pretty low compared to the normal like industry prices of how software like this can go for. And you can tell just from how I demonstrated how quick I was able to sync all that stuff. I literally did it with in 30 seconds maybe even less than 30 seconds so like I said this is something that's gonna save you hours and hours of work and another little thing that I noticed whenever I was using this is anything that you can't sync that you might have put in there such as like b-roll or maybe if you have the mic turned off um, whenever I did this originally it placed it all organized over to the side which is something that I just kind of appreciated so you can tell there's a lot of like work and quality built into this there's a lot of thinking built into this and whether you're doing video work with me making regular music videos or whether you're putting together a bigger project this is something that I honestly would highly recommend you look into so go ahead and check out all the links in the description like I said um, I usually don't make kind of like software review videos a lot of my stuff is usually just tutorials talking about different effects putting out music videos stuff like that but I felt like this is something that could honestly help a lot of people um, so I really wanted to talk about this share this with you guys hopefully this helps you anyways guys like I said leave a like subscribe if you guys are new all relevant stuff will be down in the description below thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys later